A decade ago, a plan was developed to restore the health of Australia's largest river system, the Murray-Darling Basin. Through the Basin Plan, water is now managed at a whole of system scale from the north to the south, in collaboration with governments to support the needs of communities, farmers and the natural river environment. As we've worked together, the Basin Plan has changed how we manage water. It's a lot of people working together, it's First Nations, it's irrigators, it's the farmers, um, environmental groups, all, all the government departments and the collaboration and the work that's happening out there is, is something to be celebrated and acknowledged and obviously we're on a path, we've got more to do but we're certainly making a difference. We're now preparing for the 2026 Basin Plan Review. The review is our opportunity to reflect on how the plan is working, explore how we can respond to climate change and how we may support the basin into the future. It's using the science to underpin the understanding and clearly thinking about, well, what, what, what does it mean in the context of uh, climate change going forward, potentially more severe droughts or more severe events, could be floods or droughts um, that we need to sort of plan for in the future. The review will be led by science, guided by First Nations and supported by basin communities. The basin and our river systems is the lifeblood of communities. I think that was really evident throughout the recent drought and the relationship that our, our water systems have and the, and the basin has more broadly with the health and well-being of community. That level of relationship to our rivers is vital to us as a community. Now more than ever, we need to better understand experience, knowledge and future climate challenges so we can provide healthy rivers for generations. The roadmap to the 2026 Basin Plan Review helps you understand how the Murray-Darling Basin Authority will prepare for and conduct the review and how you can get involved. It steps through how different perspectives and information about our environment, economy, social needs will be gathered and shared to inform the way forward. We'll inform the review by working together. We're focused on responding to climate change, our sustainable water limits, First Nations involvement and simplifying things through regulatory design. Everyone with a passion for the future of the Murray-Darling Basin will have an opportunity to contribute to the 2026 Basin Plan Review. We need to ensure the Basin continues to respond to our changing environment and the needs of Basin communities, First Nations and industries, while supporting the Basin for generations to come. Over the next three years, there'll be plenty of opportunity for communities to get involved, whether they're communities in the basin or people outside the basin. The basin is something that's important to all Australians, and we want all Australians to have their say in terms of what the future of the basin might look like.